welcome to the History Quiz January 2024 with me, Joshua Daniels. So, this is the first of 12 History Quizzes, one will be released every month. They try to cover a variety of countries, a variety of different periods of history, and thus it will try and aim to be a quiz that everyone can get involved with or at least have a go. The rules are very simple. Number one, no conferring. You can play as teams or on your own if you want, but there's no discussion or cheating between teams or players. Rule number two, no using search engines or internet to find out the answers, so that also includes pausing the video to give it a go. Number three, one answer per question, one point per correct answer. So there's no multiple answers needed for one question, and there's no multiple points for each individual question. And number four, there are five categories, 30 questions with 15 seconds to answer each one. You do not need to answer all the questions, but will not get a point for questions left unanswered. So, if you all have pen and paper ready, we'll sw move swiftly into the third category. And the first category is Famous Faces. So the rule of Famous Faces is, there's going to be 10 questions, there will be 10 faces, I'll show you a picture of a famous historical figure, you have to just simply write down the name of that historical figure for one point. So, if we're all ready, let's start with face number one. Let's move on to face number two. Let's move on to phase number three. Let's move on to phase number four. So move on to phase number five. So move on to phase number six. Let's move on to phase number seven. Let's move on to phase number eight. Let's move on to the penultimate phase, phase number nine. And the final phase, phase number 10. And that marks the end of the Famous Faces round, so let's move on to the second category. And the second category is Events and Dates. So the rules for this one are very simple, but they are slightly different. So, I'm going to show five events on the left-hand side of the screen, and there'll be five dates on the right-hand side of the screen. The events will be marked 1 to 5, and the dates will be marked A to E. You just simply have to match the events up to their correct date. 
Now you get one point for every event and date matched up correctly. And you're instead of having 10 seconds per answer, I'm going to give you a minute to finish off the entire category. And I've la labelled them 1 to 5 and A to E for ease. So that way, if you don't want to write them down, you can write 1 to the corresponding num letter, 2 to the corresponding number e letter, etc. Or you can simply write down the answers or whatever you feel is necessary. So we'll have a minute after I finish reading out the events and the, the dates. So let's move on to the second category, events and dates. Events and dates. So the first event is Battle of Hastings. The second event is the start of the American Civil War. The third event is the start of the Hundred Years War. The fourth event is the Vikings land at Lindisfarne. And the fifth event is the death of the last samurai. The date the, on the right, A, 1337, B, 793, C, 1861, D, 1877, and E, 1066. You have a minute starting now. Ten seconds left. And that's the end of the second category. Moving on to the third category now. And the third category is true or false. Very simple, you can probably guess how this one works. So there will be five questions. What I will do is give five historical statements. You just have to answer whether you think they are true or false. 10 seconds per question, one point for every correct answer. So, let's move on to the third category, true or false? True or false? Number one, Edward Teach, also known as the pirate Blackbeard, died from eating poisoned swan. True or false? And that's 15 seconds rock, so I should have said it's 15 seconds, not 10 seconds. Is or false? Number two. The Viking Leif Erikson was the first European to set foot on North America. True or false? Question number three. True or false? Number three. The flushing toilet was designed by Sir John Crappington. True or false? Ultimate question, true or false? Number four, cocaine was used by soldiers in the First World War. True or false? And the final question, Number five, the deadliest earthquake in human history was in China, 1556. True or false? And that marks the end of the true or false category. Moving on to the next category, the fourth and penultimate category. It is which came first? So I'm going to give two events or two historical points in time. And your 
the task is simply to put whether you which one you think came first so let's move on to the fourth category which came first number one which came first the last guillotine death in france or the invention of the big map Moving on to question number two. Which came first? The start of the French Revolution or the start of the Cultural Revolution in China? Question number three. Which came first? The death of King Henry VIII the fall of the Aztec Empire. An ultimate question. Number four. Which came first, the Romans leaving Britain or Queen Cleopatra's death? Final question of this category. Number five, which came first, the USA being founded or the Spanish Civil War? So we're on to the final category now, general history knowledge, five questions, one point per answer, 15, question, 15 seconds per question. And the rule is very simple. It will be general history knowledge. All you have to do is write in the answer you think is correct to each question. So without further ado, let's begin the fifth and final category, general history knowledge. Number one, which rigid airship was destroyed by fire in 1937? Question number two. What nationality was Socrates, ancient philosopher? There's no philosopher wrong there. Question number three. Who discovered penicillin? Ultimate question, number four, where was stainless steel invented? And the final question of the final category, number five, how long was the Second World War in years? Time's up and that marks the end of the January 2024 quiz. So, get ready to mark, we're on to the answers. And if we're all ready, we'll start with category number one, which was Famous Faces. So, number one was Rosa Parks. Number two was Isaac Newton. Number three was Mao Zedong. Number four was Amelia Earhart. Number five was William Wilberforce. Number six was Martin Luther King Jr. I will accept Martin Luther King. Number seven was Genghis Khan or Temujin. I will accept either. Number eight was William I. I will also accept William the Conqueror or William of Normandy. 
Number 9 was Julius Caesar, and number 10 was Harriet Tubman. So as you can see here, what I've done is I've marked each of the answers to their corresponding correct number, to their correct date. So number 1 was Battle of Hastings, which goes to E, 1066. Number 2 was the start of the American Civil War, which goes to C, 1861. The number 3, the start of the Hundred Years' War, goes to A, 1337. Number 4, Vikings land at Lindisfarne, goes to B, 793. And number 5, the death of the last samurai, goes to D, 1877. The next category, number 3, true or false. Number 1, Edward Teach, also known as the Pirate Blackbeard, died from eating poison swan. That is false. He actually died from gunshots and stab wounds. Number two, the Viking Leif Erikson was the first European to set foot on North America. That is true. Around 1000 AD, Columbus was 1492. Number, number three, the flushing toilet was designed by Sir John Crappington. That is false. It was Sir John Harrington. Number four, cocaine was used by soldiers in the First World War. That is true, mainly for medicinal purposes. And number five, the deadliest earthquake recorded in history was in China in 1556. That is true, it was in the Shaanxi province and it killed an estimated 830,000 people. Although a lot of those were actually after the earthquake itself had passed. The next category, which came first? So which came first? The last guillotine in death in France, or in France, or the invention of the Big Mac, it was the invention of the Big Mac. Number two, the start of the French Revolution, or the Cultural Revolution in China, it was the start of the French Revolution. Number three, the death of King Henry VIII, or the fall of the Aztec Empire, it was the fall of the Aztec Empire. Number four, Romans leaving Britain, or Cleopatra's death, it was Cleopatra's death. And number five, the USA being founded, or the Spanish Civil War, it was the USA being founded. And finally, moving on to the final category, general history knowledge. Number one, what were, which rigid airship was destroyed by fire in 1937? It was the Hindenburg. Number two, what nationality was Socrates, ancient philosopher? He was Greek. Number three, who discovered penicillin? Alexander Fleming. Number four, where was stainless steel invented? In Sheffield, in England, by Harry Brearley in 1913. And number five, how long was the Second World War in years? Six years, although if you want to then do it in six years and to the exact date, I will accept that as well. So all in all, I hope you all had a good time playing. Thanks for playing along, and I'll see you all in February.